Okay. Well, maybe that'll make someone not park on top of me, right? Right. <laughs> hey, peeps! You like my neon? Yes, it's so bright. You can definitely see me today, right? <laughs> Don't miss me. Okay, guys. So, a while back, you saw us do a video on um, shopping at Goodwill, I should say. And we decided that day when we were here that we should come back to the Goodwill store and actually buy stuff for the women's shelter here in Montgomery County where I live. So today we're gonna go in and we're going to shop for clothes for women and clothes for little kids. Um, because you know when a woman ends up at the women's shelter because of abuse or whatever, normally they don't really have any clothes with them. They normally leave sometimes in the middle of the night with just the clothes on their backs. So we are going to go in and get a few, quite a few hundred dollars worth of different things for them. Um, we have been already told that they, we really can't film um, dropping the stuff off. So we're gonna do our best at trying to show you where this location is and um, me actually handed it over to them because we've done some research, we've done some phone calls this morning. So anyways, let's get inside and have some fun picking this stuff out. Goodwill or spotted out of uh, coming out of Dollar Tree. Dollar, uh, no, Hobby Lobby. Dollar Tree. That's where we got caught. Dollar Tree. Oh, and today it was Goodwill. <laughs> we thought we looked bad enough that nobody would recognize. I know. Us all sweaty from our workouts and everything. But of course. So we got three huge bags. I was actually the car's gonna run me over. I was actually aiming for five hundred dollars. And with the size of the cart and how overflowing it was, I thought for sure we were getting close to 400. I know. But we literally walked out with, what was it, 281 or something like that? Yep. Close to 300. So, anyways, we got a lot of women and a lot of kids stuff. So, hopefully, this is going to make somebody happy. We're going to throw this in the car. We're going to film as much as we can, which I don't know how much we're going to get to film. So, stay tuned. Okay, guys. So, we are pulling into the Portofino Shopping Center. Apparently, this place is located. 
located in here somewhere. Um, ooh, big hump. Hello. I guess it's my turn. It's a roundabout. <laughs> <laughs> let me go, please, let me go. Um, so supposedly, oh wow, they've redone a lot of this shopping center. Wow. Um, okay, what's this lady doing? It is down here in this other shopping center. I don't know why they said it was in the Portofino, because this over here is not Portofino. Portofino is right. over there. So, there's a Mexican restaurant tab. Oh, okay, don't cuss at me. Jeez. <laughs> she didn't even stop. Oh, she was like, I don't care if this car hits me. <laughs> yeah, she saw the... She saw the Bentley. She was like, she oh, shit, yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fall. She was like, this is it. <laughs> okay, how do we get out of here? Go, oh, okay, so it's right here. It's called Something Special. And supposedly, this is where you drop your stuff off at is here no they do not have to buy their stuff so what she explained to me is is when they come to the uh, women's shelter and they get checked in and everything what they do is they give the women these vouchers and these vouchers they bring from the women's shelter over to this location and that voucher allows them to pick up pieces of clothing or whatever they need I guess so instead of going through the front door we're, we were told that we need to come around to the back and I don't know if I need to call them and have someone at the back of the store or if there's a buzzer that I just push maybe so let's see if we can get to the back of the store this way is it gonna say something special probably this may be it where all these donations are being dropped off. Dropped off. Yep. Yep. No dumping. No, we don't want to dump. We just want to drop some stuff off. Monday to Saturday, nine to six. you've made a donation they give you this piece of paper and I really I literally had to write my name on the clipboard with my zip code and how many bags we dropped off and everything and so this says thank you for your donation you've made today so um, their, their shelter houses up to 75 women and children every day 365 days a year Annually, more than 800 battered and abused women and their children seek refuge with us. So, guys, it's it's a very worthwhile cause. And if you are anywhere here in uh, the Woodlands, Texas, Spring, the Houston area, I really would like people to um, either get stuff out of their closets or go to the Goodwill Salvation Army, uh, not really Salvation Army, but Goodwill. Look, look, we literally did an entire shopping cart overflowing and it was $281. Mm -hmm. I was, I mean, I could go back and get another cart full and, you know, so literally we'll, we'll probably do this again because I was impressed with how much stuff we got for so little. Yes. Um, and to be able to do this, it's just, it's an amazing thing. So guys, there you go. Guys, that was so much fun. Wasn't it, Fab? Yes. <laughs> it was so much fun to just just go and know that price did not matter, throw as much as we could in that cart. And literally, I, I had no idea how much we were spending. I mean, I, my goal was to spend 500, um, but you just really didn't know how much everything cost. Some things were $3, some things were $2, some things were $5. So it was kind of hard to keep track as fast as I was throwing it in the, ba in the cart and everything. So. What matters is that we delivered three humongous bags full, almost $300 worth, um, and there's a lot of stuff there uh, to the Women's Center. So, um, like I said, that, that women's shelter at any given time houses over 75 women plus children. So, 
like I said, if anybody's in the area and they can do what I did, and or even just a little bit, it doesn't matter. Shoot, for 25 bucks, we could have taken a lot of stuff, you know? So, anyways, always fun to give back, always a blast. Hope you enjoyed the little shopping trip. Uh, hope you enjoyed a little bit of just being a good person on this earth, you know? And we just need to wake up every day and think there's always people less fortunate. So help your neighbor help. You never know. Someone's got a story. So with that said, guys, get out there. Find me everywhere. Hey, guys, make sure you even find me on Cameo. Because even on Cameo, I can do shout-outs to you guys. Mm -hmm. And I haven't been asked for a long time. So find me on Cameo. There's another way to find me also and get a shout-out. Some of you having a birthday, pay for a shout-out from me. It's... It's so much fun. You'd be how, yesterday I was talking to a girl. She's like, I can't believe I'm talking to Teresa Romer. She was so excited. So anyways, guys, with that said, until next time, bye-bye.